Yeah. Absolutely, you can tell. Look at the baby. She's very full stomach. Very big and round like a balloon. Very happy because they had them all recently. I just wonder where the other youngster is. Maybe he's left at the kill. You never know. Oh, so he's very, very well fed, yeah. Look at that. He could hardly walk, yeah. They clean themselves. It's a, it's a typical attack to have here. And after I just said Merlin, they'll lie down somewhere and start letting, letting their paws and walk their face off just to, uh, to get the blood off the, the faces and, and all over the body. So what the magnificent kids, yeah. Mm, on the oh, this is Induna. Mm. Uh, <laughs> Uh, morning, uh, Charlie. You just uh, located on a gorilla um, on the single um, on Pimpa uh, on uh, Philemon Steep, the uh, very static at the moment. Uh, Charlie, thanks. Uh, we're making our way down there now. We're on that quality now. Okay, come here, too. Oh, what a way to start the morning. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> Very good start, yeah. Um, very nice morning, Sunday morning surprise, as you said. She could have called something bigger, call a female in power or young, or young in power. You can just tell how how full the uh, the bellies are. That's why she hasn't been seen for uh, for about two weeks. So she was obviously uh, uh, sitting by the kill. So the tra the tricks that you guys had to the machine. Yeah, she sure. been they're going. Sure. Yeah, they were coming uh, from Valley Dam to water and then headed back to the kill to finish up. So she obviously finished up this morning. She's coming back into the territory here. Yeah. She's got a fairly large territory here. Yeah. yeah, girl. Well, watch yourself, Andy. How are you, mother? Yeah, the family to flat cat at the moment. Okay, cool, thanks. Yeah, at the moment just two uh Jim of Yakko uh responding to uh, to the sighting, so yeah. Um I think yeah you can stick your time. It's the pretty stuff. Because everyone is <laughs> responding to this team as well, absolutely yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm very curious where the other one is. Uh, me too. Still on the other side of the, yeah. of the drainage line. But the, the other night, the direction that I uh, found them, and they were all pretty cool. I mean, they, they came right here um, uh, to the vehicle, and we were very curious to look at the house and we to start uh, playing around around the vehicle, which was very nice here. Yeah. But I haven't seen them during the day, so this is like my first time to see, uh, to see them during the day, which is very good. Yeah. Beautiful kids. Just look 
the black markings behind the ears. Um, communication and, and, and following mechanism here. Yeah. Look at the other part of the home seat. He kept looking in that direction. And maybe the brother. Yeah, I think he's seen him now. Yeah, maybe the brother is also coming towards them. So they're both looking very intently at the moment. So they could have had him coming or smelled something. Leopard are also opportunistic, even if they uh, welfare like that, if, if something come by, they will definitely get up and give you the go. I've seen a, f a female uh, leopard uh, just uh, down south uh, in the sands, and she had a day cup um, in a tree, and then she, she went down to, to drink water um, at the river, and then on the way down, and she, she killed the bush bucket, and she was up in a tree, and she, and then she went down to, to drink water and on her way back just between the two coals and then she called uh, the impala again. Yep. So she ended up uh, with three different coals in different areas. So she finished up the first one and she went to the second and the third. So they, they kill whenever they can. Uh, we have, we've got a question here from Jennifer uh, who wants to know how long uh, will the cup stay with the mother. Um, I've seen the, uh, the, uh, the female leopard also in the south, in the southern part of the Saudi sand, um, a bed in the cup at the, at the age of about nine months. So it's, it, it, it can be any time uh, between a year and, and a two years or so. Um, but sometimes they can stay long, long, longer than, than two years, two and a half years, just depending on the situation. But yeah, they can abandon it. Uh, it, it, it at the age of a year to two years and so. The leopards are, are very, very good hunters. Um, the, uh, and again, the, the, uh, they, they, they can live, live anywhere. Um, there are leopards just outside the reserve um, in the, the local communities as well as the, in the urban areas of Johannesburg. So they, they live every, um, or they can survive anyway because they live off. They've got a very high success rate um, in hunting as well. They've got a, between 70 and 80 percent of success rate, which is very, very good. You said she's five now. Yeah. It didn't, I don't know if you heard what happened at Landalosi. There was a very old female leopard, and she um, she she had a, 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 the first litter. No, it was actually the second litter, and but, but she abandoned um, for about five, six years, and she she had a single cub because she was getting older. So they so they uh, uh, the more they get older, and they less they 